so freaking hot. All right, so that's a bit windy today, but what we're gonna try is like to try this Cinehoop Bumblebee with the new firmware, so Betaflight 4.2. I uh, had a bit of struggle like to, to fly the new firmware yesterday but I think everything is fine today uh, It's pretty like the default configuration just a bit of uh, PID tuning like the new uh, RPM filtering We're gonna find out today we're just gonna see if this baby still flies well And uh, yeah I think I'm gonna try to record some DVR, no stabilization and with the GoPro GoPro 7 after We're in the middle of Bangkok So yeah, yeah I mean let's just fly put some battery on this baby and see what we can do. That wasn't bad. I mean, I'm gonna take the flight time home but I think it was pretty much the same as it was before. The motors are quite burning, but I've been punching them. It's not burning, it's quite hot, but it's super hot outside. Now I'm gonna try to fly uh, with the GoPro, see how I feel. Just gonna get to the footage, DVR and GoPro. All right, so let's have a look at that uh, DVR on the bottom left. So what I see in my goggles, uh, I'm using a DJI. Uh, transmitter and you get the GoPro in the background uh, so basically that was so the first pack with the GoPro so the first thing I noticed on the DVR is like uh, it's it was super shaky it has always been a bit shaky um, I don't know if it's getting worse uh, I have to check maybe the mounting of my camera uh, of the DJI I need the camera that is wobbly that is not fixed well uh, I don't believe it's the motor, I mean, I don't know, let, let me know guys in the comments if you have any idea, but uh, it occurs like in a certain frequency, like uh, mid-throttle, I would say, as you can see, so there is no issue with the GoPro because the GoPro is stabilized at hyper smooth, of course. Uh, so I'm just trying like a straight run, uh, going back and forward, see I have no, no wobbles, nothing when I'm in a, in a higher speed. Uh, so I'm just playing, I feel pretty confident with the quad, it was like the third flight, so I'm just going there, going up, hitting the throttle a bit, still wobbly, and the split test. Um, so I just want to see if I get any washout or if I have any uh, issue with the motors, like getting wind in the duck, stuff like that that already happened. Nothing so far, uh, it was quite a successful dive for a cine whoop. All of this is done in uh, echo mode. I think uh, later in the in the flight uh, I'm gonna go back in uh, angle mode. Uh, so same here. Um, looking for a second dive. It's a bit windy. I was pushed in the last moment. I can remember. Uh, oh, let's go. So just diving, no throttle, pushing back the motors. Everything feels fine. Um, I really like the feeling that I get in the motors with this um, because I have the V side compensation. So now, I mean, it was 100%. So basically, the battery, I'm on the 4S, so the battery felt the same uh, during uh, all of the flight, during the whole flight. Um, so yeah, I think that's pretty much it. The only thing that bothers me now is like it's still hard, I mean, to fly smooth and slow okay so this is what i'm trying to do now i don't think the quad is behaving like not normally because on the footage like i mean the quad is going straight right uh it seems pretty stable it's just the camera so i'm gonna see if it's if it's the mount uh or if it's really the motor uh, maybe on the next flight i will try to have a look at the black box see how the motors and my pids my pnds are are behaving um, so, so far, yeah, uh, just trying to, to see what I can get. I think I'm now in horizon mode. Uh, yeah, I do have, I remember. So my quad is not very well leveled uh, and was windy. So it was just going a bit on the right and a bit backward. So just looking around. It's not as wobbly as it was in the beginning. It's still quite smooth for me and landing 
So as we can see, I mean, I was pretty happy uh, with 4.2. I mean, the quad is uh, is flying even if I have issue with uh, flashing the firmware. Um, I like it so far. Uh, I still unsure I want to run uh, the black box things just to check my PNDs, my motor rates, everything. I need a bit of tuning. My motors were hot. Um, I mean, it's time and it's like 35 degrees Celsius outside, so maybe it's normal. Uh, I might go back to the 4.1 to see if I can feel any difference. But many things to try, um, and we will see that in, a, in the next video. Ciao.